Uh, my name is Rajesh Shatila. I'm professor of uh, robotics, artificial intelligence, and ethics at Sorbonne University in uh, Paris. I've been in uh, robotics and AI for over 40 years now, and uh, I worked in many uh, issues in uh, this area, including uh, uh, planning, decision making, uh, control architectures, learning, human robot interaction. Uh, and uh, ethics, of course, uh, because this is uh, beginning to be a very, very challenging issue, not only for uh, building trustworthy AI, but also for technical research. So Humane AI is uh, a project. It's more an endeavor as, than a project, actually. It's, it's uh, uh, shaping the whole AI research for the future. We want human-centric AI. What does this mean? It means that when we develop this technology, which is an overreaching technology, very important for our future, uh, we should really keep human in the center, which means this technology is there to serve humans, to benefit humanity, to benefit individuals, to benefit society. It's not there to be developed by itself. Uh, it's there to uh, make our uh, well-being uh, increase to uh, make our understanding of uh, what intelligence is increase. It's really there to help us to grasp better our future. It's a formidable tool and that should be developed correctly to help us uh, increase, ex exactly increase our uh, benefits from it. Uh, Blue Sky Project in AI, of course, every researcher in AI wants to understand what intelligence is. Uh, and uh, we have different uh, approaches to that. Uh, I think that uh, to understand intelligence, we need to understand how intelligence interacts with the real world, uh, because the real world puts uh, the limits, actually, it puts the challenges. Uh, the world is changing, it's uncertain, it's complex, uh, it's very difficult to understand and this is what intelligence is about. It's making sense about the real world. Uh, it's not working in a uh, um, abstract simulated world. It really has to uh, address the, uh, both the real-time constraints and the evolving complexity of real world. So my take on what, what would be a real blue sky project in in artificial intelligence is to make it interact with the reward and understand how it can do that efficiently.